course, today is full of traditions, and one of them, decorating cookies. That's why we have head baker, Will Marie Rivera, and lead baker, <laughs> Hannah Peterman, from Margeline Pastry, our neighbors right here yes, in New Haven. right up the street. Thank Seriously. you for being here Thank this you morning. Thank you so much for Thank having you. us. Of course. So, who does the baking of the cookies? Both of you? Um, mostly, uh, we'll say Raul. Nice. He's the boss. Yes. He's the boss. He rolls this uh, wonderful dough and turns it into cookies. And Miss Hannah here, uh, she does most of the decorating for the cookies. Beautiful. So what goes into a really good sugar cookie? Has to be good butter. Uh, Always. And we do use butter. shortening as well for the molded cookies to make sure that they maintain their shape. Um, once you cookie cutter them, if it doesn't have the shortening, sometimes they'll flatten out or the shape will change. So we want them to be pretty uniform. Yeah, we want them to look pretty, shape. but we want them to taste good as well. And uniform, is that important too with the baking process? Yeah, absolutely. Especially for these cookies, um, as you can see here, we like to uh, bag and tie them. So we use a royal icing, so once it hardens, they're good to go. They don't get squished. Yep. So we want them all to be, you know, pretty the same. A lot of people come in and buy a ton for their grandkids, their family. So they want them to look, you know, pretty. Yeah, <laughs> pretty course. similar. Is this royal icing? So this is, is royal, royal icing. icing. Yes. So what go goes ahead in, and snip that. What goes into royal icing? What a makes of, it a lot of powdered sugar? A lot of yeah, uh, egg, white. egg whites. Now you just start at the top. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So this one has a little <laughs> bit of water in it, so you don't have to go too thick. It will um, kind of dissipate oh. throughout. Oh, so is that so too thick? That's I'm already, okay. It, I'm you know what? <laughs> it'll sit for a minute and spread out. You're it'll so be kind. perfect. So yeah, we add water to those How did you get that ones. pretty effect, like the lines? Did you so just these ones, um, <laughs> these ones I did use. Um, we had a tip, the baking tips, like a little star tip. Yeah. Um, and this one doesn't have any water. So these ones mm -hmm. that we use with the water, it will give a nice flat, smooth that surface. That actually looks pretty good. Yeah, ah, it looks good. Thank you, ladies. And then so yeah, sprinkles. we have all sorts of you know colored sugars, sprinkles. These are some right. little um, royal icing flowers we made ahead of time. Well, let's get to it, Beautiful. ladies. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> so we have. Have some other colored bags over here that don't have the water added to decorate on top. So the now, cookie ones are pretty cute. Where do you get these little bags to be able to? Um, we kind of cut them ourselves. Yeah, our boss yeah. actually cuts them, them out of parchment. And we just kind of just learn how to roll them and put them together. Now, what do you? Oh, this is. Well, how do you make it? That's does that does not look <laughs> that pretty. One, it's okay. That looks That's like. That's okay because you know what? When in doubt. Throw sprinkles or sugar on it. That's what we say. Yep. Either drizzle it with chocolate, <laughs> sprinkle it, and done. And this so, has got to be a fun activity to do with the kids, too. I mean, absolutely. You can get them involved in the baking process and they can kind of get creative. Absolutely. Yeah. And then you get all your cookies done with little helpers. Um, are, were you super busy this week? How we was Easter for you guys? We were very busy, yes. Yeah, it was really nice. Um, we are going through a little bit of a change at the bakery. Our boss has recently bought Eddie's Bake Shop in Ansonia. Yep. Oh, wow. So, you know, our staff is kind of uh, split between the two. We miss them. Yeah, we <laughs> miss them very much, but they were very busy. Yeah, they're We super were very busy. busy, so the bosses were pretty much just running back and forth all week. It was, it was pretty hectic, but we made it. I feel like my cookies look more like Picasso or something. It's more okay. abstract, if you yeah, will. Yeah, abstract is good. <laughs> and uh, you're not open today, but no, you not. said Tuesday you're going to be we'll back We'll be open? reopened yep. Tuesday, 7, 7 to 6. And what's your specialty? Everything? Um, everything. I mean, everyone loves our fresh fruit tart. It's vanilla pastry cream, fresh fruit, and hazelnuts. That was one of our big sellers for Easter. Our bunnies. Our bunnies. Which are technically our mice. They're made of chocolate truffle and an almond cake base. Oh. We like to dress them up, so they kind of just change depending, you know, if it's Christmas, they're Santa mice. Um, sometimes we turn them into turkeys, <laughs> and then we turn them into bunnies. The people it. love them. Versatile. And they're I like delicious. That. They dress up for the holidays. I love it. Well, ladies, yeah, thank you so much. Absolutely. This was a lot of fun. Thanks for having I got to keep working on my Picasso yeah, cookie here. Oh, sure. Yes. More colors, the better.